Hello guys, look who I've got here. I'm excited. This is exciting. I want to introduce you to two excellent musicians, my friends, Mike and Lily Lutchen. Yes. And they have agreed to do the soundtrack for the encaustic video. So it's not just going to be how to learn how to paint with encaustic. You're going to get into a groove when you're learning. I want to be I want this to be the best video you guys have ever seen. And so I have, I'm just so excited. So I just want you to meet them and get excited about their work and how we work together. Mike. Well, Carolyn, uh, this, this is, um, we were looking forward to this, to this meeting. Uh, it's, it's always, it's always good to meet artists and musicians and various people that share a similar vision of art and music and all the type of nonlinear and linear type creations to work together, because um, uh, nowadays it's uh, it's it's a a time to to bring out art and creativity. So this is we're really looking forward to this project because um, we we um, we immediately got along, and that tells you a lot right there. Yes, thank you. And Lily, I mean, how how are you looking at this project? I mean, what do you? What do, you, what do you think you're going to get out of actually being a part of this whole? Well, the connection of uh, people together is very important, I think, in coming up with music. We'll inspire each other by uh, the music that we're playing and the art that you've done. It's, it seems to shake hands really well. And this way we can be exposed to your friends and your circle of friends and, and vice versa, bringing uh, your work into a, a, a new realm of of um, people that a lot of us from the 60s and 70s who uh, thought that communal living and communal artistic uh, musical ventures were extremely important and we never gave that up. We always had that desire to do it and, and it seemed we were isolated in certain ways except for the internet but now you're a real person <laughs> and we're real people and it just uh, seems to be going in the right direction. Cool, cool. So, I mean, what what's behind your music? I mean, what's what's the message in your music? I mean, they're gonna learn how to how to master encaustic, or at least how to start to master encaustic. But, I mean, with your music, with your sound, what are you trying to what are you trying to point people to? Well, we we always had this love of science and technology. We always thought it was really cool. Um, some of our our heroes, Nicholas Tesla, Albert Einstein, Timothy Leary, um, uh, you know, the, the, uh, all of the scientists that actually loved art and music themselves. So we said, how can we make danceable music that has a great melody and has a driving hypnotic rhythm to it? So we, we said, let's put all that together and, and how to humanize science and technology in a way that it wasn't just cold and calculated and it kind of had there was kind of a humor to it and we always said the idea was spacey sexy and silly <laughs> was was the idea of our music yeah very very true I like to have a message that was uh, helping people let's say become better body engineers or uh, you know look at politics from another point of view our political satire uh, pieces that we've done uh, you know, but yet have that beat, that dance beat, the, uh, the, the draw to make a culture out of it. Wow, and if anybody has seen some of my YouTube videos, you know I love to dance. So when I heard, Lily, Lily gave me like this CD, she says, here, Carolyn, you're listening to some of our music. Man, I listened to that thing about three times. So the first time I put it in, I listened to it three times over and over again. It's hypnotic. It's great. I just fell in love with it. I wasn't even going to do music on my DVD. But then when I thought, hey, this would be great. And they said, yeah. So I'm um, in. Also, guys, listen out. Um, there's actually going to be like a little clip of their sound after this, after this, so you can hear that. And thanks so much for inviting me yeah. into your studio. I mean, hey, my studio now is my home, too. I, I paint better when I'm in my home. I, I think yes. you heard the birds there before. You know, it's like, hey, this is really cool. So yep. thank you, thank you, thank, thank you. you. Thank you so <laughs> much. Thank you so thank much, Carolyn. <laughs> okay, All right. uh, coming up next. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think that 
How was your trip to the Dog Star? Fine, but did you notice that crazy peeping Tom? Do you think we should invite him in? Is this candid camera? Must be. Now back to the Dog Star.